Another crisis. Oh my gosh! Rampage! This is actually pretty insane. 300. Here we go. Unload. Mate, can't they... There we go. There's a kill. This is a fully loaded tester with a bunch of new stuff but let's start with the ultimate edition specter orkin so it looks like kind of a regular specter but you'll notice the specter doesn't have the new skin yet but the orkins do so if you actually look at the stats it's the exact same even the same description same ability but it has more durability on paper anyway so 166,000 durability and this is the regular specter and then this is 138 so 30,000 more HP, which isn't a ton, but we'll see what other changes they make. And then the ultimate Orkin. So notice this, range of 350 meters and a lot more damage. So what is that? 3,400 damage and then regular Orkins have 2,300. So I don't know what percentage that is, but that's quite a bit. So 50 meter longer range, same reload, more damage to the ultimate Spectre Orkin. Let's see if this thing is now meta. New drone as well, showdown drone. Um, robot cannot lose its weapons, which is one of the skills or whatever. Robot gains speed while in stealth. Robot gain gains damage bonus when it loses stealth. So this, this drone is kind of built for like the Spectre or the Crisis robot, which is kind of interesting. And the last but not least, the new freeze weapon. So you can see they added a skin to the Rook Titan. And these are the alpha for, or not the alpha, the alpha and beta freeze weapons. The reload time is 140 seconds, That, but that must be wrong because that must be a glitch or just a miswrite because that's obviously not right. 140 seconds, like the whole game, man. In 300 meter range, they work the same as like glacier or cryo weapons. Um, so that's how they should act. And then we have um, two crisis or three crisis robots loaded up. Oh, and, the, and then the unstable conduit. So cooldown time, 15 seconds, and it gives you repair durability. So repair and a damage bonus. Tons of new stuff. Let's hop into a game. And then we also got to try Yaman Tao. Okay, here we are on a death match for Shenzhen. All right, let's see how this goes. Okay, so we, just, we have just under 200,000 HP. Oh, that looks very different. Did you just see how those weapons fired? That looked very, very different, man. Okay, let's move along. Crisis robot. Oh, that... Okay, that's a bit of damage there. That's a bit of damage. Boom, okay, smoked him. Smoked him. Okay, is this really the ultimate Spectre Orkin? We don't have a ton of HP. I thought they would have given this Spectre a lot more HP. Because we're still under 200,000. That means on the live server, we're probably going to have like 230, maybe. Uh oh. Oh, Skyros and uh, Nether. Okay, hold on. These guys, Skyros here. Whoa! Okay, that damage is definitely more impressive. Oh, look at the reload buttons. Look at our firing buttons. Oh, they did not. Okay, they didn't say the reload was different than regular Orkins crushed look at our firing buttons right now the reload is way faster for these orcans way faster orcan reload another crisis oh my gosh rampage this is actually pretty insane holy bananas my teammates running bro my teammates running the specter but he's not running the special edition version he's running a normal specter orcan you gotta run the uh, the ultimate edition man it's way better. Uh oh. See, it, they didn't say if we have any kind of resistance, but I don't think we do. Kill. Okay, man, it feels like the clip might even be better. Be bigger. Misspoke. It's early. They're okay, stacking. Oh, there's like five guys over here. Another crisis. That damage is crazy, man. Another one. Come on, triple kill. Man, this damage is big time. The damage is very noticeable, but the... Whoa, whoa. Scorpion. Okay, rampage. Is it, that's our second rampage, right? Yeah. We're gonna get ahead of our rampage. Let's get a godlike or something going. Um, come on. This guy, this guy, this guy. Hiroshi, Hiroshi. 
and delete godlike men the explosive area the splash radius might even be bigger another roshi beyond god like we're just churning up these aroshis get to hades there man we're racking up kills for my team here we're up 18 to 8 right now yeah the reload must be half the time it looks like the reload's like 10 seconds on these organs which is a huge improvement. It's like half. Living legend. Man, somebody count out a reload? I'm kind of big. I can't really look at it. It might, I think it's under 10 seconds. It looks like it's 8 seconds or something. It's a rook. Oh, does the rook have resistance in the sky? I can't even remember. I cannot even. Oh, multiple rooks. Multiple rooks. We're at living legend though. This guy, Capri. Oh, Living Legend, another one. Another one. Okay, well, it's pretty obvious this Spectre Orc. And the only issue is we're on the test server, obviously, so there's no... Whoa! What the hell was that? Who killed me? Somebody killed me with Veyron? I didn't even see that. Okay, let's... The only problem with that Spectre or testing it out is players aren't really running pure meta stuff like they are in the live server. So there's no one really running anglers, not many seraphs, a few ethers. But my point being, we can't really tell how actually meta it is until it hits the live server. But I guess there's no way around that really. 300, this thing's so slow. 300 meter range. Oh, bro, it's literally a copy and paste of the glacier. The weapons... Uh-oh. Oh my gosh, this thing's slow as hell. Move! I'm stuck! Oh, move, you fat ball of mustard. Okay, we lost all of our shielding. Heal me up, teammate. My teammates, my teammates got like a Heimdall or something. Oh man, is the healing bugged? He's a serious, but we're not healing up right now. Well, that sucks. We didn't take... We didn't heal up at all. This robot is extreme. This rook is so slow. This is such a weird robot. Look how slow we are in the sky. This is going to be so annoying to use. I'm sure Pixonic's going to buff it last minute, though, and make it super overpowered before hitting the last server. What? 300! 300! There we go. Okay, we didn't get the kill, but either way. Yeah, the, the firing effect, it looks like a copy and paste. I used... You guys saw me use the glacier, like, yesterday. And the firing effect and the sound is even the exact same. There's one. Okay, here we go. Unload. Titan Slayer. There we go. We got a kill. We got a kill. All right. And I do have a quantum sensor on here, so we can hit enemies in step. That's worth noting. Oh, that's kind of weird. Oh, there's obviously a bug. We're at 32 kills. Actually, maybe that makes sense. Yeah, okay, maybe this makes sense. They got one more player here. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna murder myself. This thing is so slow. I haven't even launched. I haven't even freaking launched here. Okay, we... Launch. Oh, that was a fail. Fail. Oh, we regenerate? Wait, is that a thing from... There we go, smoke that guy, double kill. Is this an ability that I forgot? We just regenerated our physical shields. Was that on the test server last week? I can't even remember. We regenerated our physical shield? That seems like a huge, like a big deal. Like on the shell bot, you can't regenerate your shields and it's kind of, you know, regular. Okay, so the game one, the takeaway from that was those Orkins are crazy powerful. 4.1 million, 14 kills. Let's see if we can get the new Yamantown map, because I definitely want to check that out. And we'll hop into a second game. Let's go game two. Okay, here we are. We got it. Beacon Rush on Yamantown. Okay, let's start with the Spectre Orkin again. So, I didn't even look. Let's see what our 199,000 HP. See, only four seconds of stealth. So, the robot itself doesn't seem that strong. It seems like it has a bit more durability, but everything else is the same. Same stealth duration, same jump. It looks like same speed. 
a bit more HP. Like, I don't know, I don't see what the big deal is. Oh, you can see for the map. Look at all the textures applied. So, we saw in those pictures yesterday. All the ground is covered in, like, ice. Oh, I really like that effect. That blue ice effect on the ground looks pretty cool. Okay, so I'm a little bit worried this is going to be a camper map, but I'm going to be a little bit cautious. Okay, remember, 350 meter range. Oh, okay, when it's stealth, you went into stealth. You will die. Don't run from me. Don't run from me! Bingo! Okay, we almost got the kill. It's alright. Let's push this beacon. Oh, someone's firing a suppression at us. Stop firing at me. Stop shooting at me. Stop shooting at me. Nerds everywhere! Okay, you dropped in here. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Let's see how good the damage really is. I think this is a Kepri. Okay, I wanna... I'm gonna jump past him. The old Spectre Orkin. Okay, I missed some of those rockets. Not gonna lie. But we're reloading already. Oh, is he gonna push? There we go. There we go. Oh, he's healing though. He's healing. Oh, it lagged out too. He lagged out. We missed some of the rockets. Okay, there we go. He has a kill. Oh my gosh. This guy's gonna kill him. Oh, we're down to 7,000 HP. We're down to 7,000 HP. Yes, double kill crushed him. We were down to 7,000 HP, but because of the showdown drone, we didn't lose a weapon. Remember, that's one of the, the abilities of this drone. We lost no weapons. So you don't lose any weapons, you just die, and we didn't die. This guy's coming back. We're fully loaded on our rockets already, our orcans. Now there's Capri. Bro, these orcans are extreme. And Ares. Oh, he just used his ability. Uh-oh, he's going to take us down. We have to get in his shield. I gravity amped him. Somebody did. Oh, I don't know how we didn't get that kill, but he's dead. We're stuck, we're stuck, we're stuck. Oh, Scorpion ambushed us. Okay, you know what? We've used the Spectre Orkin enough. Let's hop into the... Um, let's... I don't know, what should we do? Crisis? Let's go with the Reaper. Okay, so we do have this Conduit active module there. You'll see 60 power cells. Conduit. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot these are, uh, these are like rapid fire weapons. I, th I was thinking they're like gauze for a second. Okay. I love how this robot literally runs like its legs are backward. Okay, there's a kill. He's 193,000 HP in this robot. Not very much, but it also has four heavy weapons in permanent stealth, so... Oh, that was less damage. That seemed like a lot less damage than last week. Two, one. Fire, fire, fire. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Four, three, two, one. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, he's low HP. Oh, can we get him? Somebody kill him, somebody kill him, somebody kill him. Get him, get him. Okay, okay, we died. All right, man, he might have nerfed the uh, the Reaper weapons. Those did not seem as strong there. Wait, why do we have... Oh, do we have an extra immune amp or something on here? That's why we're at 216,000 HP. Okay, here we go. Let's see what we can do here. 350. Ooh, that range. I thought it's 350. Oh, this guy's coming straight at us. Here's an angler, man. Unload. Nice. There's an angler kill. A meta kill. That range isn't right. That's, they, that's so weird. They forgot to implement the, the 350 meter range in these weapons. The range is... The range is still 300. There's some damage. There's a little bit of damage. They even changed the firing effect. That's so weird. They literally changed the firing effect of the weapons. Ooh, last hit triggered on us. Oh, he's jumping. He's jumping. Whoa! Whoa! We're flying. We're flying. We're flying. Okay, so the one thing they didn't implement on these Orcans properly. They said it, the range is 350 meters on paper. But that's not the case when we're firing, so they gotta fix that. Okay. Big, big boy Rook. This thing is so slow, and I hate the way it walks. It walks like it's, it has a little strut. <laughs> Look how it walks. <laughs> it walks so stupid. 
Okay, we get the center beacon if it matters. 300. Here we go. Unload. Man, can't they? There we go. There's a kill. I know it's the first... Uh, oh, there's a guy. Okay, let's hit our ability. Boom. Hit him. Do we... Oh, guy killed himself. He killed his robot. That sucks. Okay, so you got you just saw we regenerated our shields. Man, I forget to look at the rook's abilities. I forgot them. So I assume one of them was regeneration of shields. Double kill. There's some minos. Oh, rook just flew past me. His, his reflector's up right now, but I hope they change the sound effects of these weapons. Don't have it as a copy and paste. Got him, triple kill. Triple kill. Unload. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. No, no, no. We gotta reload a bit. I forgot to look at the reload was on these weapons, but I assume it's not super short. Okay, go up. Oh. Can we hit him? No, we can't hit him. Regenerate the shields. Regenerate the shields. The shields are not regenerating. There, we regenerate the physical shields, but he's got rockets. Or rockets. Oh, the teammate. I think killed me. Meatballs. Okay, let's, um... Drop quick, drop quick. They're mecking, they're mecking. Oh, I didn't even really try out the conduit module. So, the re the advanced repair unit has a 10% um, repair rate. And the conduit has an 8% repair rate, but also like an 8% or 10% damage boost. So, it's obviously worth using because you get a damage boost as well. 4.5 million damage, two beacons, not too bad. So, okay, that was a lot of stuff to take in. Yamantau map looks pretty good, but I'm still li a little bit worried about the campers. The Spectre Orkin is lethal. The Orkins are lethal, but I think if they want to make the Spectre the ultimate Spectre edition, the ultimate edition Spectre meta, they're going to have to give it some kind of resistance with its ability or a bit more HP. Um, the Freeze Titan weapons are pretty good as expected. I think the Reaper got nerfed. The Showdown drone is good. And the Crisis is still game-breaking. So that's the rundown. See you guys tomorrow. Peace. Cheese McMuffin Sandwich.